Hey lovely folks, welcome back, or welcome, and if this is your first time joining into the channel, again, hello from me, and of course, hello from Bic. It seems like Bic will actually join us for this final journey. Bic, would you like to say hello? Yeah. I know she was not visible in the previous video, but here we are, we have her now, and I'm very excited. Okay, I cannot hold my excitement because I have something to say. Um, first of all, again, I would like to apologize because the previous video, for some reason, did, did not render completely. I missed out on that, so the last, I would say a minute and a half, two minutes were cut out from the outro. It was actually my best outro so far, <laughs> apart uh, from 12 videos, and it got cut off, probably, I don't know, for a reason. So let me try to redo that again. Also, um, this will be officially chapter 13, which will be... The final chapter of The Last of Us, Part 1, the remake for PS5. I am ready, I am excited, a lot of things have happened, and I would like to talk about that since I got cut off. Um, also, I would like to say I hope everyone is having a fantastic week because I am uploading this video at the very last few days of June, so I hope everyone had an amazing June and even a better July ahead. Let's hope everything will be super cool and awesome in July. Um, so here we are. Let me just just open the game screen. Good. Uh, what happened so far? Crazy journey. So in the last chapter, the previous technical chapter, Ellie fought off David. David, which I keep calling the CEO of the Hunters, tried to kill her. Of course, of course that he did. And uh, it was very brutal. I would say everything that happened in the photo was very brutal, very emotional, very raw. Yes, very raw. And uh, we ended up. Uh, Joel and Ellie reuniting and they making their way to Salt Lake City, which was the place where we were looking for a hospital where the fireflies are. Uh, long story short, we do find a hospital and um, we meet back with Marlene, which she is the CEO of the fireflies. And then Marlene, Marlene tells Joel that in order that is, there is a possibility for a vaccine to be created, which could potentially save man mankind, thanks to Ellie and her um, and her blood. But for that to happen, the doctors have to take the cordyceps, like the uh, the infection, out of her, uh, in order to examine that and make the vaccine from it, which means that it will start affecting her brain and she will turn, which technically means that she will die. So, how do I feel about this? I feel bad. I honestly feel really bad. What I want what I want to ask is so there are two solutions to this. One is logical, one is emotional. Now the logical solution is that you sacrifice one person in order to save all of humanity and nobody is ever going to get infected. Life is going to go back to normal possibly. Like you never know, but maybe that is what is going to happen. And the other one is option number 2, the emotional one. Ah, uh, the emotional one as it states, is based on pure raw emotions to save somebody that you actually love. And for uh, Joel, that is Ellie. Because they bonded excessively a lot, especially in the last chapter after uh, he saw what she went through with David and the Hunters. And um, it was so emotional. Like, he called her baby girl. I mean, I, don't, I was just, I don't know, I was in tears. Like, on the inside, I was in tears, okay? And, um... I would like to hear everyone's opinion in the comment section below. Please let me know what decision, if you were up put into this task, what decision would you have made? Like, there are no wrong answers here, okay? Would have been the logical decision or would have been the emotional decision? This is based on what type of a person you are and I would like to I would like to know you know to get to get to know you because I think this is a really good way. So if this is the homework, I would like to hear your thoughts and opinions about that. Uh, of course, probably I would like to hear everyone's opinions about how this game is going to end. But um, let's just get to the end and then we can talk in the outro. I'm excited. I don't know how long is this chapter, but it is the final one. So it's possible that this video will not be as long as usual, guys. It may be one hour. I don't know. Maybe I'll die a lot of times. Maybe it'll be two hours. But I will be prepped and ready to wrap this up. And I will do my best to do it a little bit stealthier and to survive. So fingers crossed. That's going to be the way. Let's... Let's go. Let's dive back into chapter... I don't know, number chapter in general in the game. This is... It's called the hospital. It's the final battle. And let's go and save Ellie because this is what Joel wants to do. And officially, this is war between 
I don't know, J Joe and Ellie and the rest of the world. Uh, named it Hunters, Fireflies, Fedra. We're all against them, so. We are all against them. Okay, now where would I start? I would take this pistol. And I will swap my shotgun. What I am going to try to do this is I said stealth, so. Let's see. Let's see. Shotgun may not be the best decision, but... By the way, it is so freaking dark because I, I got no... Uh, oh, bad choice. Can I redo, please? Can I do a redo? I kinda messed it up. Yeah, I messed it up. I messed it up, guys. I messed it up. Can I allow myself to die and redo? I would like to do that. Like, really, I would like to do that. I would like to really do that. Let's see. Oh. Spot it. Too soon. Whoa. Yeah, well, they no mercy for anyone. I'm sorry, but I gotta do what I gotta do. Did anyone spotted me? Hmm. No, actually, actually, no. That's good. Huh? Uh oh. Whoa. Uh -oh. Okay, good, 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 good. They don't know where I am. I still have a chance. I would have had a better chance if I actually grabbed them, but damn. There's no such thing as stealth for me, okay? <laughs> Not with them. Not now. Don't let him get away! Here he is! Oh my god, let's go, Joel. Time to up. Was that all of them? For now it is. For now it is. I have to get out of here. I have to get out of here. Now, they're coming all on this side. What do we do? Might be best to stay here. Mm-hmm. Okay, take this. That's the only guy here. I did not see many um, bricks or bottles, so it's gonna be a challenge. That's okay. Okay, there's also a way over there. Uh, in that room. Is there somebody in the room? Yes, there is. Not a good option. Still an option, though. Let's see. Two guys coming up from this way. There are so many of them. There's just so many of them that there's no way you can stay stealth. Like, completely stealth, at least. Okay, one enters the room, the rest do not. I have to get inside of this room. Wait, hold up, hold up. Ba my bad. Maybe he's gonna move up and I can try to get him fast. Yes, that's my golden chance. Let's go grab him. That's it, stealth. Good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Oof, I got a rifle. Damn. But I'm gonna keep this for now. Just for now. Just for now, okay. So... Hmm, how about this guy? Is he gonna come this way? 
Now, if I move there, he might decide to use this direction. I'm being spotted by who? By who? Where? What? That's not good. That was not good either. I had to do it though. I had to do what was necessary. Medkit, I have enough. Come on, I gotta use them. Now, is there a way to go that side? No, I don't think so. Everyone is alerted now. This is very bad. Shh. Not good. Everyone is really alerted. Not good. Whoop. He doesn't see me, though. Take him off, take him off. Good. 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 Nobody on that window. Nobody covering the window. Very bad strategy, guys. Okay, come on. I got you. God damn it. Yeah, god damn it. God damn it, really, really. <laughs> Everybody on this window, let's go. Good. Two more out. Two more out. Do I need a Molotov? Even if I do, I don't have enough resources. Not even for a med kit. Okay, never mind. Uh, let's go. Now, I'm gonna continue again. On this end. Hold up. Hold up. They're right there, yes. Millions of them, millions of them. There's a brick, so I might use that brick. Uh, let me just get it. Good. Gotta get into that, that. I have to get into that room on the right side. That is my option. My best option, I would say. Yep. Here we go. Nice and steady. Nice and steady. Good. So they didn't enter the room. How do we proceed? Well, there's a lot of places here, a lot of places. Huh? Yep. Come on. I know you're fucking here, man. Yada 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 yada. Over there. Oh damn it, it's two of them. Don't try to shoot me while I have your buddy. guys have tough armors. Gotta run. Making my way downtown. Going again. Through the window. On side. Here we are. Come get me at the window. Come on. I'm right at the window. Move up. You cannot miss me. The window is my spot. I have everybody here. Come on. Move up. Over here. Oh, damn it. You shouldn't have said that. I should have broke you. Bad turn of events. Oh, it's because I had my flashlight on? Oh, that's my bad. Don't lose him! Okay, he doesn't see me now. I might have a chance. Hey, he's a... Shut up, Jesus. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Okay. That's all of them for now. Good. Now, where were we? Uh, going back into this room. I'm gone, definitely gone. Whoops, some ammo. 
I'm full on rifle. Can I directly start using? I'm gonna start using that rifle. Assault rifle, here we go. So. The thing is, we still want to do things a little bit stealthier. If it comes to that. If it comes to that, I'm gonna use all necessary power. thing is I cannot sneak behind them and I don't want to because I want to cover the entire area I'm not planning on leaving any any of them alive after what they did I'm going through the emotional choice I'll probably jump over here Oops. if you see me come over here a brick nice good that's gonna be handy. So, one remains there. Two remain there. I think one moved up. Or did he? I don't think he did. Yeah, he is over here. Apart from this dude over there. Uh-huh. One on the spot there that is technically protecting him, but now he's gone. That's gotta be him. Didn't see me. Ah! Yeah, I'm the smuggler. I'm loving this turn of events. Where's the other one? Flank me. You sure? You sure that's possible? Tough choice, buddy. Tough choice. I gotta tell you, tough choice to flank me. There's one more. Nobody on this end. It's just this guy. One, two, three, move up. Good. Okay, I'm safe here. It's fine. There's just one of them left, I think. It's just this guy. Come on. Come on. Where are you? I <laughs> think he's afraid to show his head. This is 1v1, buddy. You, you gotta do it. You gotta show yourself. Come on. Come on, be brave. You were brave a little bit while ago. Come on. Oh, damn it. He's not gonna do it. I'm gonna be dumb enough to walk his way. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Okay. Now, how about we look around this area? Everything's calm now, and I got all of them. Um, I don't sense anybody for the time being now. Let me see. What do you guys have for me? I need some pills. I need some medication. I need a bunch of things. You better have something good. Let's see. Good, good. Let's go. Nice. Still not enough? Really? Okay. Well, this floor is clean. Now I'm taking this ammo with me. Thank you very much. Uh, let's go this way on the right side. Did I kill everybody? Yes, okay. Just to make sure somebody does not decide to surprise me. Oh, snacks! Cool. Oh. Smoke bomb. Uh, bottle. Good. There's a door 
right here. Hmm. What else? What else? What else? What else? Come on, give me the goodies. Nothing else, I suppose. I think that's it. In this area. Ah, wait. There's a reception room. Okay, here's only a brick. I would not take it, thank you. Mm, that's kind of it. Oh, nope. On the office, maybe. Yep, cool. And that's it. I'm all packed. How many pills do I have? 70. Damn, I'm only missing 30. I won't be able to do the full upgrades. Sad, I'm sad. Okay, let's move on. Here we go. Next place. This hospital is huge. Down this way. Stay alert. Oh, oh turn it off, Joe. Oh my god, seriously. I got you. Oh, it was my fault, technically, so. I don't care about you guys. Ooh, I'm on war. <laughs> like, no stealth anymore. I'm at war. If you give me a rifle and you say that we're having a war, then I'm definitely gonna use that rifle. Just saying. Okay, shouldn't we make... Well, let's craft something nice for them. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. So, where was I? Okay, all of these guys are down. You got some bullets for me? Nope. Should have killed you stealth. Gave me no bullets at all. Oh, which way do I go now? Oh, shit. But very bad. Very bad. I got spotted again. I keep getting spotted. Maybe I want to do this the stealth way. Stop spotting me. Where Jesus. the hell are you? I am not here for sure. Do not listen to your intuition. <laughs> oh, I probably am here. You still shouldn't listen to your intuition. Uh, nobody. Is that it? They keep coming up one by one. What is the reason? <sighs> This place is so dark, such a dump. Let's take this. You know what? I have a better idea. Since I'm not gonna use it anyway, they're no more infected. Why don't I use my flamethrower against these guys? Uh, why not? I would say, why not? Okay, what is over here? I think that's a generator. Cool, I can craft a medkit. No? Still not. Mm. Should I use the shift? Yeah, I'm gonna use the shift. Okay. Cool, yeah. Something else? I think that's it. Let's turn off this light. Let's get in. Woo! Let's go. Where am I going now? Oh, joke. Here they come. Here they come. Wait, they're trying to open the door? Hold up. Do we think they're gonna open it? Do? Yeah? Yes or no? I guess I shouldn't stay to find out. Okay, I'm gonna make my way up here. Hmm. 
Which floor? This is the sixth floor, I think. Where am I now? Oh, this is it. This is it. Get in. Whatever that is. Okay. Okay. Now I have to move out, hide somewhere. Ooh. We had a recorder. April 28th. Marlene was right. The girl's infection is like nothing I've ever seen. The cause of her immunity is uncertain. As we've seen in all past cases, the antigenic titers of the patient's cordyceps remain high in both the serum and the cerebrospinal fluid. Blood cultures taken from the patient rapidly grow cordyceps and fungal media in the lab. However, white blood cell lines, including percentages and absolute counts, are completely normal. There is no elevation of pro-inflammatory cytokines, and an MRI of the brain shows no evidence of fungal growth in the limbic regions, which would normally accompany the prodrome of aggression in infected patients. We must find a way to replicate this state under laboratory conditions. We're okay. about to hit a milestone in human history equal to the discovery of penicillin. Are you kidding me? After years of wandering in circles, we're about to come home, make a difference, and bring the human race back into control of its own destiny. All of our sacrifices and the hundreds of men and women who've bled for this cause, or worse, will not be in vain. I mean, if he put if he puts it like that, um, okie doke. I did not remember that this pandemic has been going on for twenty years. So, yeah, man, kind of has a point there. Oh my god! Oh, a shift. It's gotta be a cool place. It's gotta be a cool place. Pendant, let's go. I think that will be my last one, maybe. Name. What is the name? Bryony Stewart Soom. Very interesting name. Oh, this is just what I needed. I just need 10 more though. Woo, look at that. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Take this, thank you very much. But I'm still gonna use my flamethrower. I mean, it looks really cool, let's face it. Should I use my medkit now? Nope. Let's be brave. Let's be brave, so... I came from that door. Nice. Good. Another recording. Okay. What is this about? It's 5.30pm on April 28th. I just finished speaking... <laughs> More like yelling at our head surgeon. Apparently, there's no way to extricate the parasite without eliminating the host. Fancy way of saying we gotta kill the fucking kid. And now they're asking for my go-ahead. The tests just keep getting harder and harder, don't they? Exhausted. I just want this to end. So be it. Marlene really does not want to sacrifice Ellie. But she's she has a cause that she has been fighting for for so long. I cannot mm, I cannot not say it does not make sense because it really does. It really does make sense. It really does make sense, sadly it does. Okay, so where should we head off? Here? It's a big corridor. There's nobody. I don't think this is a safe zone. If there's nobody, I better take the chances. Let's craft the med kit. Right on, let, let me just use my medkit. Let's go full health. Now, I would love if I get 20 more pills. Just 20. 20 is all I need. What is this? A note. 
Oh, it's a diary. March 15. We finally crossed the Yuda border. In a couple of days, we'll be back with the others. Today, the crew was in much better spirits. I've been worried about their morale since Greg and Tanya's passing last week. It's good to hear them laughing again. Robin came up to me and said, Thanks for watching over us, Merlene. It was a small gesture, but I needed it. This is Merlene's diary. Uh, a week later. Ellie never made it. We arrived at the hospital. There was much celebration, at least from the others. I guess they're happy to see their old friends. We haven't seen some of these guys in over 10 years. After they told me the news, I couldn't eat. I couldn't talk to anyone. I should be grateful to just be alive. But right now, I just want to shut my eyes for a bit. A day later. They look at me and I know what they're thinking. That we're a bunch of incompetent grunts. What was I supposed to do? I thought I was going to die. My men were being hunted by the entire Boston battalion. I had to get her out of the city. How was I supposed to know the Firefly escorts were already dead? I hear somebody behind me. I hear somebody, by the way. God damn it, I panicked. In the end, I healed pretty damn quickly and my men were more capable than I gave them credit for. More than a handful survived the army's attack. I should have kept her with, with me. Instead, I handed her off to a couple of smugglers. I failed you, Anna. I failed all of us. I'm an incompetent grunt. A month later, which is, I think, nowadays events. I can't stand talking to any of them. I don't think I can take the str stairs any longer. No way I can stay here. And this is literally, like, now. One of our scouts just ra uh, radioed in. He spotted an older man and a young girl entering the tunnel. Whoops, sorry. What the hell was it? Went. Ah. Oh, is this so so? Older man and young girl entering the tunnel by the bus terminal. He thinks she might have had red hair, but he's not sure. What if it's her? Stop doing this, Merlene. The Reckon Squad is about to head out. I'm going to join them. On the same day, when you're lost in the darkness, look for the light. She's alive. They're running the tests on her now. I can't tell if I'm excited, scared, or just nervous. All I know is my hands won't stop shaking. Okay, Merlene. I really swear I heard somebody opening one of the doors. But there's still nobody here. Why was the place so empty? That's just weird, isn't it? There are a bunch of... Yes. I said that was right. Where? This way? Okay. Not behind me at least, but... There's so many of them. Okay, this room is still untouched. Intact. Nothing here though, nothing for me at least. Mm. Nope. So many, so many. One more room. Nothing here either. Up oh, a brick. Mm, yeah, why not? Let's take the brick. It's a bit silent. Can I still try to go back? I'm not sure if I searched the entire place up. Or did I? Yeah, well, I can go through this door, which will lead the mission to open directly there. Okay. No need to do that. Let's head off. Let's go get the rest of them. Over there. On this side, really? <sighs> Let me guess, there's nobody here. This door I don't need, so... close. I'm very close. I am very close. Okay. 
Nobody through this corridor though. So there's a door there could be used. We brought the kid all the way from Pittsburgh. That's all I know. My sister should have questioned me myself. Mm-hmm. Should I directly go on that way though? I will be spotted the very second I move. Don't take that chance. But I do want to go that way. Made it. Made it, made it, made it, made it. Okay. Now I'm gonna try to attack them from here. Seems like a safer approach to me. Do that. <laughs> it's an operation room or something. Okay. There ain't nobody here. Directly skipping through them. This way. There's the second or the first guy there. Hope one coming up this way. Hide behind the laundry. Okay, good, good, good. I think he might be coming this way. This guy. He has to see me or maybe not. Maybe not. Too many of them, though. <sighs> I'm really gonna use a flamethrower. I'm, I'm really not kidding. It doesn't have much range, but hey. It might do. The guy didn't see me. You hear that? Bad news is they're all coming in. Nope. He backed off. I think I'm gonna go straight in. I think I'm gonna go completely rogue. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna go completely rogue. I don't care. First guy is this. Okay, good. You can't see me? Nope. Should we flank him? I mean, flame. It's gonna be some flaming. Come on, turn around. Turn around. say that was that worked well but it was still something <laughs> it was still something got the bottle it was still something okay she lost me pretty fast she herself lost me pretty fast let's see smoke bombs i can also use smoke bombs Hold up. Hold up. Come on. Make your way up here. He's coming. Oh, he's gonna get away again. I'm very stupid for doing this, I swear. Dumbest approach. Dumbest approach. <laughs> Dumbest approach. But it's fun, you know? It's fun. 
Don't miss the pooch. Okay. Maybe try to be a little bit more better. Yeah, let's try and do this. Is he not dead? He's not dead. Okay. We gotta be soon. Don't worry. You gotta be soon. There you go. Yeah, I'm right here. You guys cannot just catch me. Oh, I'm literally right here. Huh. Huh. Okay, time to use the other med kit. Because I played it stupidly the first time. Get a bomb over here. And then I make you guys step up to come closer. Come on. Oh. You definitely want to come and catch me here. That I bet you. Oh, one guy is going to get it. Watch. One. Two. Three. There he is. Oh my god. He went around. Damn you. What did you win around? It's just so simple. It's so simple. So goddamn simple when you went around. Like, seriously. <laughs> Bow and arrow. Okay. Maybe they're gonna move up now. Come on, guys, move up. <laughs> Oops. Reloading. Who, me? Why am I the one who's gonna be dead? I don't get it. You really gotta come and flank me, guys. I mean, there's literally no other way. You really just, just, you kind of just have to, you know? Damn it, damn it! I failed. Of course, there was somebody there. Don't let him get away. Hmm. A victim, finally. Okay, cool. How many? There's just a few of them left, anyway. That one's a brave one. That one's a brave one, I gotta tell you. Stupid and brave. Okay, where are the others? I think it's just one left. Yep, he's coming in. He's also stupid. That's the last one. Pretty sure that's the last one, yeah. Come on, you son of a bitch! We can can we negotiate something? Okay, obviously not. I was up for negotiation, but you're kind of not, so... Okay. Goody. I think that was all of them. Mm, I don't sense anybody else. Yep. That was all of them. GG's. Now, how many of you guys forward? Or was the last one of them? Was that all of them? Oh, let's see. Okay. Good and good. Maybe something here. Nope. Here. Nope. This way? Nothing? Really? Hmm. Also, there is no workbench, so whatever I have, I have. No upgrades possible. Let me see. Up here, maybe, where I got them. No, nothing. Oh, oh, my 
Okay, the effect of my, my bomb was meant to be for our bloaters, so... Yeah, I guess it had a really bad effect on humans. Mm -mm, not good. Not good at all. Plus 18. Plus 18 on that one. Pediatrics. No, definitely not looking. Okay, this is the door. This is the door. This is it. Let's see. Oh, there will be more. I should buy me some time. Okay, cool. What did you say so, Joel? What are we looking for? I'm not a recording, let's see. Let's play this one. Hey, Anna. It's been a while since we spoke. I, uh... I just gave the okay to proceed with the surgery. I really doubt I had much of a choice. Asking me was more of a formality. I need you to know that I've kept my promise all these years. Despite everything that I was in charge of, I looked after her. I would have done anything for her, and at times I... Here's a chance to save us. All of us. This is what we were after. What you were after. Was well, Ellie's mom a doctor? Have to kill the smuggler. I'm not about to kill the one man in this facility that might understand the weight of this choice. Oof. I feel bad now. Maybe he can forgive me. Oh, I miss you, Anna. Your daughter will be with you soon. <sighs> I really don't like this now. Genuinely, she really did not want to do it. I, and I, I think that Merlene and Ellie's mom, Anna, were like really, really, really close. We don't learn more, I guess, but maybe, I don't know. I think this will be the last recording from Merlene, for sure. There was a door. What else? That's it. One more door, guys. Let's see. Radiation? Wait, is this the surgery room? We're here. Get the guns. I think we're here. I think this is the operation room. Shit, let's go. Let's get in. Sweet Jesus. Doctor! What are you doing in here? I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. Do I just have to punch Don't him? Come any closer. I mean it. What do I do? What is the worst I can do? I think this is the worst I can do. Doctor, put this put the scalpel down, doctor. Put it put it down. Put it down. Put it down. <laughs> Okay, maybe I shouldn't have flamed the doctor. I just, you know, the soldiers did not inflame so fast. Uh oh. Oh man. Oh. Okay, listen. You guys will be safe, okay? I'm, I'm not taking any more lives. I did not want to take the doctor's life either, but he kind of. Okay, let's just forget about it. I'm just, I'm just taking Ellie. Goodbye. Come on, baby girl. I got you. There we go. I got you. Oh, I have to make, make my way with her? How do I shoot? How do I shoot? Run, Joel. Run. Run. Get you out of here, girl. Oh, no. This way, this way. What's with the music? Oh no. 
No! Oh! Shit. No! No! Let go of her! Let go of her! No! Okay, I have no idea which way I have to go. I have no idea. Let, let me try to do this again. Oh! Shit! I think okay this there's an exit that that is an exit this way this way uh this way left left go go I said get back get in get in get in hey stop That's one weird elevator ride, isn't it? Okay. Let's go to the parking. Yes, that seems legit. Okay, okay. Come on. Come on. Oh, you can't save her. Not really, no. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. <laughs> it ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. And you know it. Look. You can still do the right thing here. She won't feel anything. What? Did I leave without her? <sighs> what the hell are you wearing? Damn, Marlene. Drugs are still wearing off. What happened? The fireflies. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. Oh, he lied. Well, there are immune. There's dozens, actually. I ain't done a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually. St they've stopped looking for a cure. Taking us home. I'm sorry. He killed her. <coughs> killed her. I am starting to reconsider if that was a good decision or not. I really am. Wait. Let me go. Please. You just come after her. Was that it? I think this is back at Tommy's. Well, looks like we're walking. Oh, that's still not the end. We gotta walk this way. Should be a straight shot through here. Okay. No, I'm, right. no, I'm playing with Ellie. It's actually kind of pretty, ain't it? Yeah. Oh my god, what the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? Whoa! Look at that view! Jackson City, here we go! I am. All right. I, now watch your head go I don't through. know. Let's, let's get through this epilogue. Yeah. Got it. 
Feeling my age now. <laughs> I don't think I ever told you, but uh, Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think uh, I think the two of you would have been would have been good friends. I think you really would have liked. Her. I know she'd have liked you. I bet I would. I'm I'm really speechless of what just happened. Of how it happened, mostly I would say. Look down there. It looks so beautiful from up here. So we are going back to the dam and Tommy and Maria. Just a little bit further now. I wonder if he's gonna tell Tommy what happened or he's just gonna lie to everybody. <laughs> I mean, would Tommy judge him? I don't think yeah, so. I got you. Give me your hand. Whoop. All right, come on. Hey, wait. Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. Okay. My best friend was there. And she got bit too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. Mm -hmm. And then it was Tess. And then but Sam. Was, um... None of that is on you. You don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what, you keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear Bella, to me. Swear to me that everything that you've said about the fireflies is true. Here we go. I swear. What <laughs> what a trophy with the watch even. Just gonna put the music down a bit just so we uh, don't get a copyright strike on it. Uh I have so many feelings and emotions. I really have a lot. I think Riley uh before I say anything else, Riley, Ellie's best friend, could be actually uh the girl from the DLC from the Left Behind. Uh where do I start? I don't know. I was actually thinking, guys, that I well, I want to do a recap video of the of the whole game, uh, recapping how I feel and whatever happened. But I still want to talk about the last chapter because this was that, the ending of the whole game. What do I want to say? I felt throughout the whole time, ninety percent of the time, that Joel was making the right de decision. But after seeing the final scene with Marlene and after seeing the final epilogue with Ellie, I am not so sure. If he made the right decision Marlene was right about one thing for sure Ellie did wanted this she would have wanted um, to be sacrificed in order for a vaccine to be found of that I'm completely sure maybe I'm not sure of many things but I'm, of that I'm completely sure I had an amazingly awesome time playing this game I'm so happy I wrapped it up uh, I would say in a um, hundred percent i tried to do it like a hundred percent completionist yes i was not able to obviously find everything i'm sad i didn't find all the pendants in the comic books but it could could do better maybe the next if i decide to play it again sometime uh it was really sweet to play this on hard difficulty it was even more amazing that this was the baby game of this channel because i 
decided to start the channel with this game specifically and those are the first uploads that you guys ever saw here and i promise there will be way more more and more to come uh but thank you for watching all of these 13 chapters it was an amazing journey i loved every single bit of it i really hope that you love the tale um i wonder if there will be a cutscene maybe no we'll continue with the credits okay i'm just gonna talk through the credits I'm, i ain't even gonna do the full screen there's just, i don't know um i love this franchise i know that there are um i i have no idea if naughty dog are planning to make a third game actually because there are two games it's not just one game but one thing i'm certain that i can say it from now the next video you're gonna see again we're gonna continue with the same schedule which will be on a sunday already in the month of july will be with the dlc for the left behind i googled up the dlc is um or around two hours so i don't know how long it's gonna take me to play it personally but i'm gonna do it at, at once so however long it takes however long that video will be because i want to do it in one go and after that you can expect a full review because i would like to like gather my thoughts and i would probably record this um maybe even before i record the lift behind because i would or I, I would like to recap how i feel and fresh emotions in the game um i would also like to hear you guys' favorite and least favorite characters like you can name one or more than one character it doesn't really matter however it is that you decide my favorite character um was i think it was tess now why it was it tess it was tess because um i felt like i could relate the most to her because of how she was very rootless but at the same time she always made the the logical decisions like she was thinking a lot and she was following through and she was always trying to do what it's right even at the very end she tried to save joel and ellie and she sacrificed herself so i would say my favorite character is this and my least favorite character i have so many characters that i just like definitely david i mean david hands down i mean david was horrible i mean David was completely horrible. He was a really good villain, though. He was a really good villain. Uh, but I would go for David, my least favorite character. So those were my two picks. So I'd love to hear yours in the comment section below. Um, also, what else? What else? Well, I'm going to leave the rest for the review. I'm not going to spoil everything. But I felt like I want to see how far ahead the second game is going to start. I have already played the second game on uh, my streams some time ago. It was a long time ago. I'd say it was more than two years ago for sure. I don't remember much of it, but I do remember Ellie was a little bit grown up. So I wouldn't say it's more than two to three years of a difference. The second game is very big though. Compared to this one, it's double the length. So it's going to take a little longer to finish. I, I'm guessing the bigger question is, will this be the next game that will be played in the channel? The answer is sadly no. Because I am planning on playing this game probably at the beginning of next year, around that time. Um, whereas I am hoping for The Last of Us Season 2. I don't know when they're planning to release it, but I think it will be 2024. Uh, also, I'd love to hear if everyone has seen The Last of Us TV show. Now I paused it uh, halfway through so I can finish the game. So I wouldn't spoil uh, everything for myself. And I need to finish it so now I can finally finish the show. Uh, if you haven't seen the show, please go ahead and watch it. It's, it's amazing. I would even say in, in a lot of ways the show kind of uh, surpasses the game. They did do a couple of cutscenes related to the pandemic that was not shown or explained which i really loved also the scenes of tess dying henry and sam they were way more emotional just in my opinion they were more emotional and i'm pleasantly excessively surprised of how hbo uh did what hbo did with the show um yeah and the second game we will play definitely the second game um it's just got to be a little bit of a longer time. But um, I truly honestly hope Naughty Dog is going to make a third game. The only thing I remember from the second game is the very last and final... I remember the very last final scene and one other scene that 
everyone who's played the second game know what I'm talking about. It was literally the game changer scene of the entire franchise. Um, and I cannot wait to play it again, if I have to be honest. Uh, every single game from now on will be on hard difficulty, which means The Last of Us 2 will also be on hard difficulty. And I cannot wait to have less loot again. Even though, to be honest, in, in, in this one, the, the looting was quite a lot, even though I missed a lot of parts. I still don't know how I tried so hard to find research for this instrumental role in the development of The Last of Us and all the contributions to the kennel during his many years with his kennel. Gratitude to Bruce Traley. Nice. I don't know, this is an amazing masterpiece from Naughty Dog, like, uh... This game, I did not know. I When I started to play it now on the channel, I noticed that it actually originally came out for PlayStation 3. And I googled and I looked up the graphics. Big welcome back at the end. <laughs> Big is here for the ending, of course. Like, she's very active today. Um, the ending, um... No, not the, the graphics on the PlayStation 3 compared to the 4 also and the 5 because I played the game on the 4. The difference is it's, it's uh, ginormous. I really love how uh, they redid the artwork and how beautiful this looks like. It gave a different perspective of playing the game and seeing the characters. Of course, it's a complete classic also on the uh, PlayStation 3. Whoever had the privilege to play it when it came out, it was probably awesome even though that was so long ago. Um, now I don't remember when was it, I think I saw it today, I think it was 2020 or 2019 of when the second game, if I'm not mistaken, one game of the year, yeah, it was definitely the second game. Uh, I remember also one thing about the second game was so dramatic, it was so emotional, so dramatic. Now if you guys think that this one was a roller coaster of emotions, you just wait for the second one, it's... It's savage. It's just quite a lot. Um, I'm truly, truly hoping that everyone loved this journey as much as I did, as much as Big did also. And I hope you guys are going to tune in for what we have next. Um, so I'm going to see you uh, on Sunday with the Left Behind chapter. I'm still going to wait out for the credits ro to roll out, by the way, before we do anything else. I would really, really love it if you guys give this video a thumbs up. And please uh, leave. I, I asked you a couple of questions. Uh, at the beginning of, of the... Uh, in the intro, I asked you if... Uh, Oh, what kind of a choice would you make in Joel's making? Would it be the emotional choice that he did or would it be the choice that Marlene made, which was the choice to save technically humanity? Also your favorite and also your least favorite character. But in any way, you can leave any sort of comments and just, um, I don't know, let's recap all of our emotions uh, and everything that we saw so far in the last... Um, whoop, I got disconnected. That was a long, in uh, long uh, intro. Let me... Uh, long outro, sorry. I think it's been... Yeah, it's been around 27 hours. That I've started, play that I've started playing this. Uh, so yes, this will be... This will be it. This will be it for me. Um, I still want to see the credits though. I'm just trying to... I love... Like, every single time I end the game. On my own, I very rarely end games. I usually do it on streams because... Uh, on streams I get the privilege to like enjoy with everyone and just finish them up so I think the same scenario will happen here and I love it so I I love watching credits also if any of you guys would like to join us live on streams you're more than welcome to do so I have the exact same username and I stream on Twitch from Mondays to Fridays full time and we can have you there we can chat we can hang out at the moment I am uh, playing Diablo 4 and FIFA 23 Yes, I play those types of games also. Not Diablo though, Diablo is the first time I'm playing Diablo, but uh, yeah, I like to do sports games also. So, uh, you don't worry, not to worry in this channel, probably will you will not see any sports games though. The next game in mind though, I can show. Hold up. No, the next game in mind that I got gifted from one of our lovely members of our community, Whisper Mr. K. Hello, if you're watching this, thank you so much. Uh, it's Dead Space, the remake. Dead Space the remake. Uh, I have never played Dead Space. I know Dead Space has a big community. A lot of people have played it and know a lot about the game. I know zero. 
I got it as a suggested uh, gift, so I accepted it, and then I got it gifted, and um, I don't know, I would just love to see what this is about, but it, it seems like it's something else, something extraordinary. So that will be the next game in mind, which will we will start playing as of the month of July. Yeah, the month of July. After we wrap this up, uh, one thing that I would like to know in uh, the left behind, I wonder if Joe is involved, but I don't think so. I really think it's gonna be mainly Ellie's story. So we're gonna be playing as Ellie as the main character. Uh, a younger, not so rootless version of her, probably. Probably, or I, I really don't know. I'm just speculating. What else should we say? I don't know, I'm just blabbering. But I wanna I wanna get to the to the credit scenes and I, I feel like there's so many things I wanna say, but I'm saving them for the review. Um what can I say? I don't know, I'm just so amazed of how this whole thing ended. I did not expect Marlene Marlene to to die, okay? I I felt bad because she trusted Joel, she really did. She not wanted she did not want it to harm him. Uh, she thought that what he was doing was right, and um, maybe she really was right. And I'm a little bit heartbroken that she died. One thing's for certain, though. In the second game, there will be um, a lot of people coming in to avenge Joel for what he did. Uh, a lot of people, like, he made enemies from the Fireflies. I wouldn't want to mess with them. Definitely can make big enemies with the fireflies. Big enemies. Ellie, I don't think so. Now, um, I truly hope nobody is gonna come after um, Uncle Tommy. We all like Uncle Tommy, let's face it, he's the good brother, we all like him. But then again, how would they know where he went? Probably they won't. We'll see. We'll see. There will be people hunting them uh, both down for sure. I'm pretty, pretty sure of that. Now, there is a lot of involvement, so it seems, from Naughty Dog into this game. A lot of people who worked into this project, a lot of art designers, a lot of... Uh, a lot of 3D artists, like, a lot of people involved into making this. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna waste any more of your time, guys. I just wanted to see this through. And, uh... What else? 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 I would... I would say that if um, any of you have never played this game or never thought of giving it a chance, maybe that would be a good time to do so. Now, the game really does start slow, but I think you're gonna love and carry out the journey. If you're that type of a player that you love stealth gameplay, this game is definitely for you. Uh, and for me, it personally reminded me a little bit of Assassin's Creed. A little bit. A little bit. And um, that could be, you know, enough to get into it and try to do things stealthily. Of course, it has nothing to do with the, uh, the way uh, things were handled in Assassin's Creed, but it was still something special. And uh, yeah, I think I'm, let's just, I will say we wrap it up because I don't know how long the credit scene will be. I think it's been going on for around more than 10 minutes right now. Give me a second. We're at the end though, but still. I'm just talking too much. Maybe we just take a moment of silence. And, uh... I got one thing on my mind. Yes, I got one thing on my mind right now. How would you also feel if you end up in the same situation that the world ended into? And, um... Would you have tried to survive? Would you have tried to look for friends? Which group would you have joined? Would you have joined the Fedra? The fireflies, the hunters, or uh, would you have been smugglers as uh, Joel and Tess? Now, there's are four different groups, or maybe even like I think the fifth group is all of the people that we saw at the beginning of the game that were just casually working uh, to get their daily the dose of supplies and miserable amount of food. I guess everyone is just trying to survive in their own way. Um. But yeah, I would like to hear your opinion. I think if it was me, I probably would have been, as I said, my favorite character, Tess. I would have went into the smuggling part because um, 
would have still tried to keep it down low, try to survive, but maybe try to make a living here and then that would probably be the one thing I would go after, I guess. I don't know. Uh, so yeah, that's something else that I would like to hear your thoughts and opinions of. Maybe we see if we match or if we don't match, maybe, you know, we can make a, um, a decision on that. And uh, yes, again, I would humbly like to thank everyone. I made a little short about it. I didn't announce it actually in any of the videos, but the channel reached over a thousand subscribers officially as of um, the 23rd of June on a Friday. I woke up and I saw the number on my phone and I was, I don't know, I was, just, I was just so excessively happy. So I would like to thank every single person that clicked the little subscribe button below. <laughs> I have to like make the button appear uh and keeping up notifications you know because i know as a user like be uh, before two months ago because you know this is my first channel that i uh as a user when i go and uh, for me to subscribe to somebody's channel you know i really have to like the vibe of, of the person i like to like what they do how they talk how they approach people and uh it honors me that plus a thousand people did that and I'm already half through my goal uh, and becoming partner with YouTube. So I really have to thank you for this. I really, really have to thank you for this. There is a little community tab in the channel that I started to use. I, I know that it's not so popular and something new for YouTube because it's just like a posting area. But in case, in case you ever click there, it's I think it's more popular on mobile. I try to leave a uh, little posts, a little thank you posts here and then and um write something below you can always go ahead and read that i also wrote a little post about hitting that goal of a thousand subscribers <sighs> i don't know i wrap it up like i've been talking for around 15 minutes i think i'm yeah it's been it's been definitely more than 15 minutes i'm amazed how many people from naughty dog got involved into this project it's like korean japanese voiceovers I should, the next time I'm going to play this game, I swear I'm going to put it in Japanese. I'm going to love it. I'm going to love it. I love playing uh, or listening to anything Japanese related because I like anime and Japanese culture. So <laughs> it'll be fun to hear Joel being angry in Japanese. That's for certain. Or Illy being sassy in, in Japanese. Um, yeah, I'm just going to wrap this up, guys. Uh, I don't know how long the credits are. I'm just going to wrap it up. Thank you again from the bottom of my heart of watching this. Uh, let's see if we have... I'm not sure if I can skip this. I think I can. But my controller got disconnected. Let's see. Oh, we cannot skip this. Really? Then we're just gonna wait it out. I guess we just have to wait it out. I will continue. The dialogue continues. Mm. <sighs> let me think let me think what i want to say i i was not prepared for such a long credit scene i was prepared for like 10 minute subs i'd like to thank each individual at ties me for contribution support dedication to the success of the last of us part one with special recognition to the executive management team a very special thanks to the following individual for their guidance and support for development I would I am going to Google how many people were involved. Mortal Kombat 2 video game image used? What? Are you kidding me? What? Okay. That's it. That's it. I think that's the ending. 2010 the lobster fonts. Okay. You get even the fonts. Do you have to use that nowadays when you're ending a game in the credits? 2022 Sony. Yeah, this was a Sony exclusive up until last year when I finally got released for PC and everyone was happy of that. That's it. It ends. Damn, that was almost 20 minutes. No scene, no nothing. No, we're back into the house. Woo! Wait, wait hold up. Game completed. You've unlocked new game plus and a speed run, speed run mode. They can be activated when starting a new game. New character skins, weapon skins, gameplay modifiers, filter modes, and other bonus content are available. And extras. Extras? What? Hold up. What do we get? Skins? Oh. 
Oh, this is so cool. Yes, because throughout the game, um... He changed his clothes a couple of times. He didn't change it that often, no! Wait, why does he have a long hair here? It looks a little bit like Bill. Can I unlock? I Oh, you have points too. I have enough points. Well, there we go. So you can unlock and use that in your new gameplay. Okay, this really makes me want to replay the game again. Damn it, Naughty Dog. You did not. Okay, let's see what we have with Ellie. Oh, that's cool. I'm unlocking this. That's definitely her style. That is... The... Like, Detroit Become Human? Maybe? That's cool. I'll take that one also. Okay, they're just all... All, all really cool. No, they're just all really cool, I swear. The backpack? No! No, this backpack is adorable. Wait, I, I know the game... Goggles? Okay, this is seriously way too cool. Bean run mode. That is something I would like to see what it's about. Uh, yeah, I'm going back. Gameplay modifiers. Speed run recap. Hmm. Your best times are safe for each difficulty in permanent mode and in the main game. New game plus and left behind. Cool. Okay. And then we have the left behind. Cool. I'm ready. This is a wrap. Again, I'm gonna say this. I'm leaving you guys. It's been more than 20 minutes for this credits. Thank you so much for being on this journey. I'm going to see you in a few days time on that DLC the left behind. Please stay safe. Stay awesome. Take care of yourself. Enjoy the month of July. Whether it's excessively hot or excessively cold in some parts of the world. Please have a lot of fun. And enjoy yourselves. I'm gonna see you soon. Bye.